In our earlier video, we have imported our Ethereum account to the Parity network. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take that address of the Ethereum account and I'm going to update in node configuration file and I'm going to start the network. Let's get started. I'm on the virtual machine. I'll go to the node configuration file. If you remember that we have commented few things over there earlier, now we are going to uncomment it. I'll go back to the bottom of the document. So I'll uncomment the password and also the engine signer. Here I'm going to paste the engine signer address here and save it, close it. Now I'm going to type a simple command which will start my blockchain network. I'll type parity hyphen hyphen config dot slash node dot toml. That's all, we are done. Now, if you see that our network is started running, we are importing the block, block one and block two and block three. Blocks are getting mined so fast, right? Because we have chosen the time as five seconds. If you feel that the blocks has to take little less time, you change the time to three seconds or four seconds. But once you deployed the network, don't make any changes to the parity genesis file or node configuration file. If you make any kind of a changes, your network is going to crash and is you are not going to get that back anymore. That's all for this video. In the next video, we are going to set up the MetaMask and we are going to deploy a smart contract to it. And let's see how we can do that.